the development of the power of the government. In the end, when the Continental Congress has finished its work and has set up a course of action, we have a move on to succeed. If there are some 15 million people in the world and put their foot down together so that the individual risk is minimized. 15 million people spread across 50 states. It's not that high a number. But there's going to be a lot of responsibility to fall on you as the state board So I would encourage everyone uh, to get everyone to get people to read each of these articles on our website, starting with the one called Summit. And there are going to be updates every day or two. Okay? Short updates, get them to get well grounded by reading all of these, and to um, uh, look to the state of Texas website on our website to show you how to get to that uh, for um, all the local news coming out of this state. It has total control of what's put on that page. Okay. We have one for Iowa as well. Well, Bob, uh, do you have a process in place for selecting delegates? Is there going to be. Uh, At the moment, the process is nominate them, send them to us. Um, I'm putting this little group together to screen them. Uh, and then we'll say uh, to you, Hank, um, here's. Uh, put these three people up there. Go to um, go to the Massachusetts website. Let me give you a little example of uh, what this is going to look like. Uh, and then we're going to ask you all to vote, you know, for your delegates. Go to the Massachusetts, go back to the state page, and then click on Massachusetts. We, took, we had some fun in, uh, in selecting some delegates uh, from Massachusetts. Oh, come on. I can't wait to select delegates right now. Uh, uh, what we need is uh, information about these people, a little bio, you know, ideally a little photo, a little bio, um, so that uh, we can say, okay, good, this person belongs on the state of Texas website as a nominee. And then eventually it will be programmed so that people in Texas can then cast their votes for the rules. So here's the uh, Massachusetts page. There's the name of the state coordinator for Massachusetts. Let's go that one day. Three delegates to represent, hold it, three delegates to represent each state on January so and so, and I'm starting to mention to restore our liberty and our constitution. That's new. We need all pages to stand and support representatives chosen by the people of each state. Ten to start. May not be a month, but a month in the long convention, a, a constitutional convention, a constitutional congress proceeding to So nominate a delegate to represent your state and click here. So there'll be a, a place to click to nominate somebody. Alright, so we'll get all the nominations coming to us on a database. Alright? Um, voting, wait, wait, voting to select state delegates commences. We'll start that well, we'll start now. It's not too soon to start. Sending us a link to get there, but don't let that stop you. Send us your send us your email. Um, and then click here for more information. And there will be a link there for more information about delegate requirements. And so in the end, you're going to get all your state changes. You're going to have your not your delegates, you know, your not being so much as you can. So we just want to just the site of your names and put them on your state page. So there was this guy uh, you know, over there in the Massachusetts and he said uh, he wants to be a delegate. So there's his picture and uh, he sent in his little bio. So we put his name up there. <laughs> and, uh, and, and we want this each nominee to provide a little statement, okay, as to why he wants to be a delegate in this continental congress. So there's uh, Sam Adams' uh, statement. Oh, here's somebody else who wants to be a uh, a delegate from Massachusetts at this upcoming conference. His name is John Henry. There's his picture and there's his little bio and uh, scroll down. And there's his little statement as to why he wants to be. Oh, there's another one. John Adams. Okay. Um, there's his bio and, and 